The next thing I'm going to show you how to do is change the permissions of files and folders. It's not really that important that you understand what permissions are for files or folders. It's just important that you understand that sometimes to fix a problem or to get something working correctly, we have to tell you to change the permissions of a folder and a file, and you just need to know how to do it. So basically, if you want to change the permissions of a file with Cyberduck, just click on the file, right click on it, and go to Info, or you can hit, click on it and hit Command I. It's going to pull up this little Info dialog box, and then the area we're interested in is down here where it says Permissions. And it's going to give you all these check boxes that you can check. And every time you check a box, this number up here changes. And in most cases, in the tutorials, or if there's a you know a problem you're having, um, and a frequently asked question tells you to change the permissions, it's going to give you a three-digit number. Most often, seven seven seven, or sometimes seven five five, something like that. But you use these check boxes to get it to the right number. And when you're satisfied, just click apply, and you've changed permissions. It's really that easy. Just checking check boxes and hitting apply. And you can do multiple files at once. Watch, I'll grab, I'm going to shift click the first and last of this chunk of files and I'm going to right click and go to info and then I am going to check all these boxes and I can make all these files 777 permissions. You can also apply permissions to folders as well. And that's how you do permissions.